Hey everybody, it is Donella. Today is Tuesday and I'm on my way to the pool, but not for water aerobics. I am taking my fat baby to the swimming pool. And I call her my fat baby, but she not fat, she's skinny. She's tall and skinny and beautiful. Say hi, pool. Hi. <laughs> Alright, so we are on our way to the pool, but I just wanted to tell this little story about uh, how my weekend went. I started to do it last night in the house, but I seem to, uh, the words seem to come a little more freely when I'm driving. So, okay, you all know how I was all upset and crying and everything going through with the people at work. And, you know, people kept saying, hold on, Donella, hold on. And I'm like, you know, what in the world is there to hold on for? Because uh, I'm about to hurt somebody in here. Because the way that I get treated at that particular um, area is not right. It's not right. To anybody who knows me knows that I am not... Um, one that's going to let people talk to me any kind of way. But anyway, I say that to say this. All of the effort that was put in to certain people trying to get my job taken away from me, I mean literally going out of their way to get my job taken away from me, their faces are cracked and they are literally gagging. Because guess who got mystery shopped and got an above average score? How about that? Yes, your girl got mystery shopped. And when I looked at the date, it was a date where um, then people were trying me. But I was still able to get it together and um, get a really high score on my mystery shopper. Um... When we get mystery shopped from the uh, corporate office of the company, they have a certain, um, you know, list that they have to go through and check and, you know, answer the questions and everything. And uh, our motto is, I am Estee Lauder. And on that question, as to whether or not I am Estee Lauder, who got a hundred percent? I got a hundred percent, y'all. Right. There were um, a few things that I could have done better on. Out of three hundred and fifty points, I got two ninety, but that's still good for somebody who's been there less than six months. Somebody who has not been instructed properly by the people who were supposed to be instructing her and then tried to turn her. And can I just say that the person who had to go over my uh, secret shopper survey almost choked to death on her words. She couldn't take it. She, could, she really couldn't take it. And, um... That made me feel good. That made me feel good because as much uh, complaining and as many stories as have been made up about me, how I'm not qualified, even though I got over 20 years of experience in the beauty industry, and certain people, okay, I'm not even going to go there, um, I got over 20 years in the beauty industry, yet um, people in executive office were being told that I was not um, properly qualified and I wasn't doing what I was supposed to do. I wasn't reading our manual and everything, which was clearly untrue, or else I would not have gotten that high school, you know? So, you know, to the people who told me to hold on, thank you. Because I, you know, I was having some serious, serious conversations with uh, my Lord Jesus. I was like, you got to get me out of here or you going to have to uh, send me my own private angel to the D.C. jail. It was almost there with these people trying my patience and things. 
I really didn't have no understanding of it. Now you see me turn on my uh, signal, but then you decide that you want to stop and pick up the trash right in the driveway when you could have done it before. Let me show you. See? See? And all I'm trying to do is turn to get into the pool. But you know, people want to be who they're going to be. <clears throat> and um, I don't know who the person is who secretly shopped me. But I want to say thank you. You know, she uh, identified herself as um, a woman of a certain age, a woman of a certain race. And she, um, you know, she complimented me. If I had the report here, I would read it to y'all. And can I just say that she let them have it. She loved me. She said that it was a 100% possibility certainty that she would return to me because she was so happy with my attitude, with my sincerity, with my um, experience, and her experience with me. So, I'm going to say this. Jesus be a mystery job, okay? He will come and he will send people to you when you least expect it. You know, when you think that um, you done fell off the cliff, he, you know, he's watching. He gonna catch you before you fall. And I had to uh, really wake up and realize that, y'all know, I was going through it. And um, I thought I was gonna have to get a medication increase and all types of things because the girls were really, really trying me. So... Here I am trying to park with one hand, y'all. Y'all know Mr. Cheeks never taught me how to park, so. You want to see how this turned out. <laughs> anyway, y'all, okay, so. That was my good news for the weekend. Somebody that was completely unbiased, who did not know me, reported to corporate office that I am Estee Lauder. And I thank you. Peace out, Girl Scouts. Talk to y'all later. Say bye, Pooh. Bye-bye. <laughs> See y'all.